Hi students, let's see the next topic that is the features of HTML5. So in the previous video, I explained the difference between the 4 and the 5. Now let's see why we are using this HTML and what are the main features that are present in this file. HTML5 introduced number of new elements and attributes that can help you in building modern websites. So if you want to construct any website, if you want to develop any website, uh, this HTML5 uh, introducing number of new, it introduces number of new elements as well as attributes. Number of new elements and attributes that can help you in building modern websites. So now let's see some of the most important features in this HTML5 or the first thing is new semantic uh, elements. New semantic elements are present in HTML5. So what about this new semantic elements? The new semantic elements are nothing but the header, footer and some section. So these are all the tags that are used to perform the forms actions and next the next feature is the video and audio elements the video and audio elements so html5 is having the embedded uh, audio and video files so these audio and video elements for media playback which can embedded on your web page without restoring third party plugins so, without the help of third party plugins, these will be embedded on your web page. Let me write this. Without resorting third party plugins, these elements uh, can embedded on your web page. This elements, that is the audio and video elements can be embedded embed on your web page so this is one of the feature of html5 a new semantics and the video and audio elements and next new form controls will be there new form controls so what are the new form controls that is providing this html5 when compared to the html the new control forms like calendar date time email url search button search link so these are all the forms which controls the uh, terms means the calendar whenever you are given the element as a calendar the form as a calendar you will a calendar will be displayed whenever you are given a date this date is an element so whenever you are given a date automatically the date at present date will be appeared time, email, URL, search. So, these are all the new form controls. So, one of the latest feature for this HTML5. And the next features, canvas element. So, why we are using this canvas element? So, this is one of the new element in the HTML5. This canvas element is used for drawing. This is for drawing what we are drawing so this supports the two-dimensional drawing surface that you can program with javascripts so with the help of this program javascript you can write draw the two-dimensional drawings by using this canvas element and next next feature is it is better support for local offline storages better support for local offline storage okay and next it is having the web socket also the next feature is web socket so what is this web socket a web socket is nothing but it is a next generation bi-directional communication technology for web applications so a web socket is a next generation next generation bi-directional communication bi-directional communication technology technology for web applications okay and uh, next uh, feature was uh, this html5 is having the feature like geolocation element 
so what is this relocation element so nowadays everyone is using this element because this uh, so now the geolocation now the visitors can choose to share the physical locations with your web applications so if you are having any web applications with that web application you can use this geolocation element to uh, share your physical location where exactly you are the, your physical location where exactly you are placed uh, with the help of the google maps that is the geolocation element next is the drag drop so uh, html5 is having the drag drop elements these i the drag drop the items from one location to another locations on the same web page so with the help of the see uh, this drag drop uh, elements the items you just drag the items from one location so in a single web page in the same web page if here the items are there you just drag the item and place it in another place drag drop so that facility is providing this uh, html5 so these are all the different features of html5 new semantic elements video and audio elements will be present new form controls will be there and the canvas element is there for which is used for drawing web sockets geolocations drag and drop thank you